People have been asking me if I could make a video about upgrading the speaker in this model pretty much since it was released. So I'm going to show you a nice easy upgrade which just involves opening up the tender and replacing the speaker in there and you can leave the speaker that's already in the boiler in place. So there's no messing about, it's just a nice quick upgrade and it's easy for most people to do at home themselves. First thing that you need to do is separate the local and the tender. This is connected by quite a wide plug and socket. You need to make sure that you pull on the plug and not the wires, otherwise there's a good chance that you'll damage them. Once it's disconnected, take the four screws out of the tender so that you can remove the body and you'll be able to see the circuit board. On the circuit board you can see the stay alive and the sound decoder. There's two more screws which hold the circuit board in place. And it's underneath that circuit board that you'll be able to see the existing speaker. Underneath the circuit board there's two metal pads. This is where you're going to connect the new speaker. I cut about a third of the wire off the speaker. This made it easier to fit the body back on once I'd finished. The speaker sticks underneath the tender body, but the area where it goes is slightly too narrow. You've got two choices. You can either make the speaker narrower by filing it down, or you can make the area where it sits slightly wider. I opted to make the area slightly wider, and I just used a pair of side cutters to cut the plastic moulding slightly. Once the speaker's in place, this is completely invisible, and you wouldn't even notice that it had been done. Once the speaker's held in place with black tech, you can put the body back on. You can put the four screws back in, and you just need to make sure that the handrails line up with the holes. And then you can reconnect the tender to the loco, and you're ready to test it. 